What's up, bros? Hey guys, what's up? Mad Season here, back with another stream for you. Greetings, well met. I feel a little bit out of my comfort zone. This is a World of Warcraft. Um, we got a new game for you here today, you guys. Wait, this is Dragon's Dogma 1. Uh-oh, did I buy the wrong game? Where's the 2? I thought this is the second one. Hang on. <laughs> no, it says 2. The title screen just, just says Dragon's Dogma. Okay, interesting. Um, so, a little bit of a preamble here. Well, first off, let me just say what's up to everybody. Dan13, thank you for the, the tier 1. UFOs, how are you? Fraggle. Uh, Tuska, Tim Allen, Ellie Belly, Whirly Bird, Grindrod, T Gobby, Craftig, Kane, Jedzy as always, Hamsfree, Gray the Hero, Yogs. Uh, what's up, Othi? Lily Koi. How's it going, everybody? Rush Turok, how are you? Um, so... If you've caught recent streams, I told you guys that I've been meaning to do a little bit of a variety for uh, a few different reasons. <clears throat> um, one of the main one, well, the main one just being, I, I just kind of want to switch things up recently. WoW will always be my main game, but I felt like... I don't know, just kind of switching it up today. Dragon's Dogma 2 has been a very, very hyped up game. As you can tell by the title, I am a virgin to the Dragon's Dogma series, okay? Uh, so we're going to start right with 2 here. And initially, that kind of scared me away from it. I felt like, well, maybe I should like try to beat Dragon's Dogma 1 before 2. I'm not sure if like I can really hop right into 2, but thinking about it more... <coughs> I decided that, well, you know what? There might be a bunch of other people out there like me who maybe haven't played the first one and are wondering... <gasps> oh, I got hiccups. If they can just jump straight into the second one, so... I'll be your guinea pig, I guess. Um, I don't really know too much about this game. Other than a little bit of gameplay, I've kind of kept myself secret to everything as to not spoil it. It looks kind of similar to me to Monster Hunter in a way, but... Not totally. It, there's more of an element on story in some ways, and there's a lot of more RPG elements, I would say. it's it's It kind of fits into its own genre. It might be kind of unfair to compare it to something like Monster Hunter or whatever, but we're going to find out. So a um, little bit of video preamble stuff here, too, just before we get into it. Uh, YouTube channel-wise... I I think it should be released either tomorrow or the day after. But I finished a Diablo 3 sort of documentary analyses video. It's the premiere of a new series I'm calling Dumpster Fire. Where I go over the, the biggest dumpster fires of social media. Um, I finished that a little while ago and I'm, I added a sponsor to it. And I'm kind of working with them to make sure that everything's good to go. But once that's good to go, I'm going to post that to the YouTube channel. Um, it's available for members right now, but give it a day or a couple of days and it'll, it'll be public on the channel. And aside from that, I just finished a script for Sekiro review. I haven't actually finished Sekiro. I have to kill Ishin, but I just, I've, uh, I've been kind of buried in editing and personal stuff. So I, we'll get to that soon. Ishin's waiting for us. We're gonna, we're gonna keep him edged out here and, uh. We'll get to him eventually. We're going to Dragon's Dogma it up tonight. Maybe we'll do Ishin at the end of the stream or something. I don't know. We'll figure it out. But yeah, I'm writing a Sekiro review. I want to break into the review scene on YouTube in the year of 2024. I'm going to get a poop ton of videos out for you guys. And if the goal in all of this is to say, why am I talking about this? That's one of the reasons why you're seeing what you're seeing here. Dragon's Dogma 2 is also going to be a game I want to play and review. As somebody who's completely new to the series, a Dragon's Dogma virgin, I feel like maybe uh, I would have an, maybe, hopefully a useful perspective for anybody else who's in the same boat. Let's see if this game is uh, worth the seventy dollars this cost. Inflation, by the way. But yeah, let's get into it. This pre-recorded note: really, I am live right now. I can I can get my phone and we can go to Times Square. I'll show you the clock there or whatever. No, this is this is live. This is live. We're like Bill O'Reilly. We'll do it live. We'll do it live! Fuck it! Alright, we'll do it live! 
Oh, you like that? Uh, Dan13, thank you so much. He says that the Diablo 3 video was amazing and great job. Thank you, Dan. Thank you, man. Alright, you guys ready? Let's just start. I plan on uh, trying to stream as much as possible here. I wanna, I wanna, I wanna no life this game. So let's get into it. I'm excited. Let me know if I need to adjust the audio levels too. By the way, I'll certainly do that. I'm gonna pay heavy attention to the story here. Oh God, I I can't read cursive. By the way, so we're off to a great start. Okay, good, good, good. Conviction is the human will reaches its greatest power. I can't read like subtitles too. Apparently, I'm really bad at reading cursive. I'm kind of embarrassed by that fact. I can write cursive, but I, I'm very bad at reading it. Name Chase, thank you, man. And Kogo as well. Yeah, me too. Thank you. Meg's the ghoul. What's up, man? Thank you. Uh-oh, is this the Red Wedding? Oh, God. I think I know where this is heading. The Lannisters send their regards. Many people have... Uh, hang on. I'm going to read this. Long as our Fevermont suffered. There'll be a lot of terminology we'll have to get into. To guide her and her people. Me. That's me. Decades have passed since last His Majesty Erland sat atop the Draken throne. This is so nerdy. Oh, oh my god. Too nerdy for me. Endured. I'm joking. Yet it has not been for naught. It's not been for naught. Uh oh, double negative. At last! The bell has tolled on the age of the consul. At last, we may celebrate the coming of our rightful ruler. Is this the third Lord of the Rings movie? The return of the Sovereign. <laughs> Is that me? Am I the Sovereign? That's me, I bet. My word. Such an inspiring visage. Your Majesty shall have my eternal fealty. I get that all the time. You know, people always say that I have a great face for radio. A great visage for radio. So, I again, I have not played the first one here, so I don't know if I'm supposed to know any of these characters or anything. I, do, I have watched all of Game of Thrones, though, so I kind of feel like I'm in my element. Ooh, Mountain Dew Code, Code Red too. Nice. I actually have that at my side. I'm cheating and I'm having Mountain Behold, Dew today. Here, listen. Before you sit the rightful inheritor of the Dragon Throne, chosen by the Dragon as you hear that enemy. fizz? Behold a rejoice! Fortune has delivered us our savior. Gamer oh. fuel in game and IRL. Praise be, for only the Sovereign's guidance can lead us true. All hail the sovereign! All hail! Let all present pledge their allegiance to the sovereign. Let us be united. Embrace the, the power the of Atom. When they are end. Long live the sovereign of Vermont! Long live the sovereign! Oh. Thou who wouldst slay the dragon. That's a euphemism for masturbation. This game is inappropriate. Yeah, this happens every time I drink, to be honest. So this is true to life so far. Excavation site Gaul. <clears throat> Ooh, I'm getting Oblivion intro vibes here. Do we have some Radiant AI coming up? Do we have over 10,000 handcrafted textures? <laughs> Where's Todd Howard when you need him? Oh, character creations? Okay, so I was going to say this. Now, this is going to be character creation, I bet. No you could 
you could I've create your... Down a record of your name and face. Yep. Come on, step forward. You're finally awake. We were ambushed at the border. You either select a prisoner to use as a preset, or select a hooded prisoner to customize your characters from Blank Slade. What if- can we be, like, anonymous? That would actually fit the most. Ooh, what if I make myself in Dragon's Dogma form? I was gonna say that you could create your character before launch of this game. I saw many people doing that. I, however, because I have a life and I was busy exchanging fluids, okay, with copious amounts of women, of course. Uh, I did not have time for that. So these are all pre-created. Are you the one then? Oh, they have furries in this game. Oh, okay. Well, that's that's the Dragon's Dogma stream for today, you guys. Uh, ah, zero of ten. You. Thank you for it showing up today. Uh -huh. I thought I recognized you. We can do a face reveal in Dragon's Dogma form. Yes? What am I saying yes to? Oh, okay. Oh, God, is this going to be, like, one of those games where you spend, like, five hours on character creation? Oh, no. So these are the races, I guess? They they do have furries. I am pretty furry in real life. I'm, like, I have a hairy person, I've been told, but not that much. Body type, what's the most Mad Season-esque? Uh, this one, of course. Boom, baby. Just your face to suit your like. Yeah, people were making like celebrities and stuff. Very in depth character creation. I don't think I'll honestly I'll I'll go like too crazy with it. Uh, Don the bear, thank you. Um, <clears throat> like the facial features, I won't do really. Wait, what? Oh, the, is this the face that I chose? Oh, I see. I don't know what my facial features are, really. Like, I'm not good at this. I might have that thing to where... I forget what it's called, but you, you can't recall people's faces. What do I look like? This is, like, the most average one, so I'll just do that. Customize it further. But yeah, I'm not gonna, like, adjust the size of my nose and stuff. That's a little bit too much. Um... Height, or of course six foot ten. We'll just do average height. I don't, I'm not sure how much information I want to reveal of myself here. I think I'll just do maybe my hair. I am incredibly muscular. Where's that six pack? There we go. Of course, muscle strength. Yeah, we gotta pump that up. Hundred. Trap size. Oh, you know it. I have I, my trapezius actually is one of my my better uh, one of my better yeah okay so this is gonna be actually my legs aren't too good truthfully upper body size oh wait no 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 okay hang on hang on I'll put that right there lower body size this is just size this isn't muscle all right yeah basically an Adonis uh, this isn't muscle this okay so the main issue I have right now is that, okay, I'm trying to create myself in real life. However, I am limited by the in-game sliders. These muscles are not big enough to accurately reflect the monotone madness in real life, okay? Uh, I'm basically Muscle Mountain, all right? And these traps are, I'm sorry, that's those are some small traps right there. Head size. I do have a giant engorged vanilla brain. Face height. You can adjust the height of your face. Neck length. We, I bet you can make really crazy looking characters. Oh, sure. We got massive delts. Oh, that's that's like, hang on, that's like Frieza level. Our delts are looking good. Shoulder width, that looks good. Chest thickness. Oh, yeah. Okay, here we go. Here we go. We don't want to have boobs, though. We got to hit uh, that incline bench a little bit more. Let's see, torso width. I say, well, that looks about right. The, the, this, the thing is, is though, like, we're going to be constantly covered in armor. This is the issue with, like, character creation. You're going to see, like, 1% of this. Oh, arm size. Okay, here we go. Oh, yes. 
I got some big arms, okay? Upper arm thickness, yep. Max it out. Forearm thickness, yep. I got the uh, World of Warcraft male human forearms. Arm length. Uh, you can make a Sekiro character. There's Sekiro character there. Actually, it's not quite long enough. Okay, lower body. I know I'm very humble, okay? Um... Honestly, my, my lower body, I'm not prepared to talk about, so we'll just, we'll just kind of, wait, movement style, can you power walk? How do I walk? Wow, this is interesting. I kind of, I kind of have uh, authority with my walk, I would say, okay. <laughs> These arms are, actually, they're maybe a little bit too beefy, now that I think about it. The knee angle. Wow, you could really change everything. I'm gonna I'm gonna actually beef down the arms a little bit, okay? Cause I, I am actually gonna make a rogue type character and I want him to kinda look like a rogue. Okay, I think that's looking good. Head. Uh I'm I'll just do um hairstyle. Here we go. I'll just do hairstyle. So right now I have pretty long hair. I have long, wavy slash curly hair. It depends on how much grease I let accumulate. The, the longer I let grease accumulate in my hair, and then I wash it, the curlier it becomes. I've noticed. So, here, the, actually, this is pretty. Uh, this is pretty accurate right here. This is pretty accurate to my hairstyle right here. It looks a little bit feminine, but then again, I guess my hairstyle IRL is a little bit feminine. Yeah, this character, right away, this character creation. Oh, they have the uh, World of Warcraft streamer haircut. Look at that. That's crazy. This character creation so far is pretty remarkable, I must say. Yeah, this is definitely my hairstyle right now. Uh, hair color is incorrect, though. We can have root and tip color. I don't think my roots and tips are different. I think they're the same. My hair color is uh, dirty blonde. Emphasis on the dirty. <laughs> this looks about right, like this. 116. And I think... Uh... Oh yeah, see, no, my, my root and tip colors are the same. The blend? I guess that doesn't matter. Sheen? You can position your sheen. I don't know where my sheen is. I don't really have a sheen, I don't think. Eyebrows, what are my eyebrows looking like? I got I got fairly bushy eyebrows. They're a little bit crazy. I was thinking of actually getting an eyebrow piercing soon. I would say maybe I'm seven. I have fairly bushy eyebrows. No unibrow, but... And what color are my eyebrows? Are my eyebrow colors the same as my hair color? I think they're darker. So I'll do 108 instead. Oh, you can adjust the thickness here. Well, how do you uh, zoom in? Okay, here we go. Zoom in. Ah, oh, yeah, there we go. Oh, okay, hang on. Incorrect. All right, we have to be able to adjust this, okay? Before we proceed, we might have to take another visit to lower body. What are my eyebrows looking like here? Oh, ooh, okay, that's a little bit too thick, I'd say. Yeah, maybe like that. Wait, my character smiled. That's also incorrect. Have you heard the tone of my voice? We don't smile on this stream, ever. Facial hair. I don't, uh... The only facial hair I have is a 5 o'clock shadow when I'm playing too much World of Warcraft. As of right now, I'm pretty clean shaven. Oh, body hair. Oh god, this is really going to get inappropriate. Um. <laughs> wow. So, we are, we're a little bit like this, I guess you would say. Yeah, that's pretty accurate. I have pretty... I don't have that hairy forearms. We'll go with this. My body hair color, oh god. Body hair density, oh we can look like a yeti. Uh, actually right here looks pretty, pretty accurate. No, we'll keep the, hang on, where's the uh, lower body? 
Hang on, we gotta adjust something right quick now. Um, waste width. Oh, you can give yourself a badonka donk. Oh, yeah, you can give yourself a badonka donk. We don't have a badonka donk. I don't skip glute day. Oh, wow. Okay, hang on, hang on. Yeah, but I'll bring it there. Leg size, thigh size, cat. Oh, they don't let you do crotch. Wow. Okay, so this is mostly accurate, alright? Mostly accurate. Not entirely accurate, okay? I uh, do not wear makeup. Lips, teeth, freckles. I do not have freckles. Do not have eyeshadow. I currently do not have any tats. I'm thinking of changing that, but right now I'm... I'm in my birthday suit. Okay. This is my character. This looks actually nothing like me, aside from maybe like the hairstyle and of course the muscular body, of course, right? Okay. Let's just be real here. All right, done. How do we finalize? Race, masculine, human? Is that what I am? I'm a masculine humor? Detailed customization, vocation. What's detailed cus? Oh, okay, never mind. Vocation. Okay, so I. When I play. Oh, I kind of look like a lady in this one. Um. A very burly lady. I. When I play RPG games, okay, I typically play the thief type character. I am a thief. Whenever I, um, so we're talking Oblivion, I was, I was stealthing around, I was getting sneak attacks, I was using archery, uh, even in Morrowind, and like, uh, Fallout and stuff. Pretty, and obviously World of Warcraft, my main and rating ended up being a rouge, so I, I figured that I would kind of stick within my wheelhouse here and be a thief. And we can like backstab some mofos, maybe we can pickpocket. These don't look like very effective daggers. I thought, like, the most important thing about a dagger is that they're pointy. So maybe my intellect stat isn't the best. But we're gonna be a thief. And I'll steal everybody's hearts. And voice. Oh. Let's see what we got here. Oh, we can test. Nope. 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 Okay, it just gets higher. Okay, that's the most like me right now. We need that deep voice. Oh, that one shows emotion. Nope, that's not gonna do it. Oh, really not a lot for voices. I guess I'll just do the Galleon Night one. Probably just Galleon Night one, I suppose. I wish, like, um... You know what would be cool, and I bet you video games are going to be at a point pretty soon where they can do this. Uh, speaking on voices here, I bet pretty soon you'll be able to um, like feed your voice data into these games and it'll use AI to actually Im import your voice and you can just kind of make some grunting sounds <laughs> like that. I bet you we're getting to that point soon. There's going to be a game that's going to do that, and people are going to be like, oh my god, that's so cool. We're getting there. All right, finalize. Masculine human. Can I not name my character? Oh, okay. Enter a name. Uh, what? My keyboard is doing nothing. Uh... Okay, we're having difficulty. Am I supposed to get like a thingy? Why can't I? Uh, I cannot type my name. Have, are you guys playing this game? Were you able to get past this point? Why can't I? I cannot type the name of the Monotone Madness. Oh, there we go. Okay, I guess I wasn't alt tabbed in all the way. Um, we're just gonna go with show. Moniker. Oh, is, is this what people will call me? Is there... 
Is there show? Anything close to show? Or you can be Saget. Bob Saget. We got a lot. Please have show. Show pop a pump. Oh, hey, there we go. Got it. Show. Cool. Age. We're not going to do an age reveal here, okay? Should I just... Are we 483 years old? Why did they let you go so old? That's crazy. Um, I don't want to do an age reveal. <laughs> so we're just going to go 69 years old, okay? Because we're five years old, actually. Um, yeah, finalized character. So you can, like, make your... You can make what are called pawns, right? I yep. like that look in your eyes. To make your party members. Yeah, pawns. That's what they're called. Uh, next. Most of your kind have eyes blank as a cadaver's. Mayhap it is only natural seeing as how you rise from the dead. Oh, you can do mad as your moniker? Oh, I probably should have done that. I'm fine with show. Mayhap. I like that word, mayhap. There's aught different about you, though. Could it be that you fear death just as we mortals do? Worry not, vessel. Three days death is a gift, okay, as far as I'm concerned. Life is pain. Come along, you feckless dullards. What are more add-ons added? You'll gain access to them as you progress through the game. So I will say here right now, we're going to get some pre-order bonuses. Um... This game was gifted to me, okay? I did not pre-order this game. Generally, wow, we kind of look like Conan, the Barbarian. I generally, I'm against pre-ordering. Anybody who knows me knows. I was gifted this game, okay? So I don't even want to hear it. Alms for the less fortunate. I just freed you. Got anything to spare? To hear your troubles. Okay, there's no one's interested in talking to me here. It's kind of um hey -o. There's so many games that start start you off like in a prison, right? Ever since Oblivion. Well, actually Morrowind you're also a prisoner. Uh how's your frame rate here? I am playing this on my editing computer, not my streaming computer. If frame rate becomes an issue, I can switch. We're not allowed to talk during missions, sir. Okay. Why is he calling me sir? <laughs> I'm a prisoner. Speak to me another time. I'm on duty. Interesting. I, am I a prisoner? I was under the impression I'm a prisoner. Why is he calling me sir? Excavation site, the hole. Giggity. I, I hear that these are... So I haven't played the first Dragon's Dogma, but I hear that it's a pretty long game. Um, any sprint? I see we have a health bar and a stamina bar, it looks like. I can only walk right now. I'm sure that's uh, just because we're in the prologue here. How are my, um, how are my audio levels, you guys? Oh, you, you like Stealthers 2, Kerrigan? Pray, do not overexert yourself. This is no place for one of your ilk. Tis harsh beyond measure. Even we pawns are pushed to the brink. Pawns. You ought not anger the overseer. Let us proceed to the site. Uh, I saw, okay, now we can run. I saw that... Um, you could have Japanese text if you wanted. Ooh, secret area. Steal everything. I played Legend of Zelda. Okay, here we go. Actually, hang on, Glowy. Digger's Daybook. Been a lot more pawns working here this past half year. Tis hard on them, and tis the rest of us. I've even heard a few of them complain, but if the Overseer gives them an order, they follow it to the letter. <laughs> Now they get all the perilous tasks, and folk like me are put on maintenance, which doesn't pay half as well. More of them <gasps> uh, were brought in last night, too, in the usual cart. 
Yeah, I heard they uh, were ambushed. Uh, if this keeps up, we'll be overrun with their elk before the month's out. So I'm not welcome here. I, like, I kind of see a little bit of frame rate lag. Hmm. Are these guys following me? Do you guys have any issue with me, like, not going where you're telling me to go and just kind of ransacking the place? Yeah, we, uh, mm, yeah, a little bit of frame rate lag here and there. You guys seeing this? It's looking a little bit choppy, isn't it? We may need to switch computers for the next session. I'm not going to switch anything for this session, but yeah, we might have a little bit of frame rate lag here and there. Whoa, 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 oh, whoa. What class is that? I want to play the phase through objects class. Uh, what are we doing? Oh, waypoint. All right, this is 2024 gaming. It would be unwise to disobey. Just follow the waypoints. The will show you no must. The thumbnail for your stream was the crotch shot. Oh, nice, beautiful. That's beautiful. That's going to be the the thumbnail for my review of this game. If you watch. So yeah, this is going to be... Okay, what are we doing? Are we playing Retail World of Warcraft? Run dailies! Every day! Collect Azerite, peasant! Get to work, you rotten layabout! If that's not I guess we're just mining. Ask the other vessels what to do! I'm not... Play Shadowlands! Bye! Are you prepared to work? <laughs> then you all begin by carrying stones out from the station in the back and bringing them here. Okay. I can do that. I'm a good boy. Ooh, light lantern. Left bumper plus... Oh, okay. I hear that a, a common complaint with the first game was wandering around in the dark. There's day to night cycles and... Uh, what, what annoyed people in the first game is... um. Grab and release. Oh, he can jump with this thing? Oh my god. My guy does not skip leg day. So we bring it, uh... Yeah, where are we bringing it? I'm, I'm not very good at following orders, apparently. Bring it up here, I guess. To these stones. A job well done. Okay. Now the next step is to... Uh-oh. Dialogue's giving away plot points. Explosion, yep, see? What is this commotion? Don't what worry, I brought my flat-edged daggers. Let's go. You heeded the overseer's commands. Yeah, it's a little kind of frame ratey right now, you guys. Give me a moment. Next time I stream this, I'm gonna stream it on my good computer and it'll be it'll be all good. But yeah, just put up for the the poor frame rate for this first session here, if you will. Would you kindly. Oh god, I think I saw this in anime before. I saw this online in a comic. I don't know if I can stream this. Ooh, it's Medusa. Kind of looks like a cool Final Fantasy monster. No, the damn thing's been awoken. You but fell that fiend, even at the cost of your lives. Follow him for no reason. Hey, priesticles, thank you, man. Ooh, weapons. What are we watching? You're watching the accurate recreation of me in a video game right here. Look at this crap. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, I don't know how to attack. Okay, carve. Oh yeah, slap that snake. Swift st twin strikes, twin fangs. Uh, uh, uh. You can dash, drains your stamina, of course, and you can also jump. Jumping attacks, okay. Ooh, dodge. Okay, so right bumper dodges. 
Switch weapon skill. Boulders, the biting wind. Ooh, cool. Grab objects and throw them. Here's we're gonna give him this fucking barrel. It's Donkey Kong, baby. No, throw it. No, throw it. Ah, ah take a barrel. Okay. I'm not sure how effective that was, but we totally Donkey Konged her. Sheath and draw. Because that's if you want to run away. So we kind of got like a... It's kind of a little, little Monster Hunter-esque, right? Like the dual blades in Monster Hunter. That's pretty thugnificent. Hey, Total, How's it going, man? Alright. Are you unharmed? I hope my parses are good. Oh god, I didn't world buff. Consarn it. No swearing. This is a Christian stream. How dare you? Oh, you! Get back here! This way or is it? Work them quads. Work them hammies. Come this way. Dash! <laughs> I'm so graceful. Attack this guy? No, this is my friend. Jump? Oh, God. Okay. Uh, hang on, I'm loading, sir. Okay, there we go. Quick, quickly get him! He's loading! Ah, you bastards. He bought an SSD. No, he just caught a griffin. Going to Iron Forge, baby. Just get a uh, a wooden boat. I saw it in Game of Thrones. Just get a wooden boat and sneak up on it somehow and impale it. A wooden boat with a ballista. That's all you need. I can't hear you. Okay, so I will try to pay attention to the story here. I will be reviewing this game, so... Oh, this is made by Capcom. I did not even know that. Wait, where's the two? Did I, did I boot up the right game? Uh... I think I booted up the wrong game. What's going on? CJ, thank you, man. We're playing the second one, right? <laughs> Can I get a confirmation in chat? Is this Dragon's Dogma 2, you guys? Okay, it is? Okay, good. I think I've entered the wrong class. It's very pretty. We're So get ready for big world exploration. Huge open world game, apparently. Lots of creatures, lots of quests. This is a big one, you guys. That's what she said. The girl has prettier hair than me, I'm jealous. She's gonna steal my shine. Oh, they are gonna Game of Thrones it. Look at this. And that's how you kill a dragon. Is that Blackrock Mountain over there? 
No, we're opening up Priesticles. Um, we might even do Chrono Trigger someday. I want to do more variety, so I think I'm going to re re remove that restriction for myself. I look remarkably handsome, even after such a catastrophe. I would, I would kind of like to do, like, maybe a retro series. Chrono Trigger, Final Fantasy 2, 3, Lufia, Secret of Mana. Oh god, I saw this in anime too. Worry not for me. The grind may swallow me whole, but I will not perish. This guy is suspicious. This guy's very suspicious. He's gonna. He's very calm in this situation. You know what I mean? Right? He's like a pretend friend, but he's gonna be a villain or something. What's happened here? Are we gonna have to dispatch these mofos? A griffin appears one moment and falls the next. And now you stand before me. Yeah, I was riding it. Was it next. you then? The one who was riding on its back. Should I? Well, actually a thief so is... You survived. Do we not have any, um... The stronghold? We'll treat your... I don't actually have, like, any dialogue options, it seems. I've noticed so far. I don't know if that's just because it's the beginning of the game. But it doesn't have that kind of Mass Effect style of... You know, if you can lie to people or persuade people. I feel like that's a pretty big part of, uh... Of uh, RPG games, we'll see if maybe that opens up. A single bolt from a ballista, and well aimed at that. Must be one of Sir Linnets from out of Melv, or uh, one of uh, whatever that dude's right. name was in Game of Thrones. Can we swim? Is the question. Looks like maybe we can. Debilitations. Uh oh, did I just did I lose the game? Negative statuses with effects that range from inflicting damage at steady intervals to making the target vulnerable for a specific type of attack. Not exclusive to the Arisen and their pawns, but can be inflicted upon their enemies as well, granting a fierce edge in battle if applied wisely. Consult each debilitation entry for more info. So it's debuffs, essentially. The brine. Oh shit, I'm, I just killed my character, I think. Tread carefully. Well, you could have told me this before I jumped in the water, maybe. The brine will lurk deep waters, rivers, lakes, and the sea. Instantly consume anyone or thing that... Oh, yeah, tell me after I jump into the water. That's just, just wonderful. We're going to have to dock a point for this. Be revived momentarily, but they're the exception. Ponds will become forfeit, and all other living creatures are met with an immediate watery death. Okay, so we have a little bit of leeway. <laughs> okay, so don't go into the water is the lesson of the day here. That is fine, because actually in real life I cannot swim, and I'd like to reveal this piece of information to you. The monotone madness cannot swim. If you ever fall into the water, do not rely on me to save you. Nay. First games didn't have the dialogue options? I see. I see. Ooh. Fine. Goblins. Let's take up your weapon, sir. You'll be needing it. Okay. So is uh, I wonder if there's a lock on. If it auto locks on. Enemies flinching crush crush Y to unleash. Ooh, death blow. Okay, cool. <laughs> what about jumping attack? Haha. Thank you, sir. We'll give you an advantage against when they're their flinching, ranks. you can death blow them. There are oft items to be scavenged from the bodies of monsters and their ilk. Oh, okay. If you're not squeamish about picking at their bones, that is. So loot enemies too. Can you carve them? Where are you Get their going? skin? I'll not force you to receive treatment, but I'd at least like a word. Ooh, glowy stuff you can search. Oops. See, it says it's giving me the Xbox 
uh, icons for everything, but I am using a PlayStation controller, so that's probably going to screw me up here a lot. I prefer PlayStation controller. There's flinching, so why? There you go. There we go. These little baby enemies, you can just kind of mash death blow on them. Level up. I'm looting. Stop yelling at me. Gather. Yeah, kind of, um... Kind of Monster Hunter-like, right? In a, in a few ways here with, like, gathering stuff. Oh, you can gather multiple times from stuff? Oh, okay. Kind of like gathering stuff on the on the fly, right? I'm gonna make a lot of comparisons to other games because I, again, this is my first time playing this. Did not play the first one, so I have no no basis for comparison, really. Well, the frame rate seems to have gotten a little bit better, but I think if I play on my other computer, it'll it'll be even better. So I'll have to get that over tomorrow. Welcome, Arisen. Microtransactions in this game? I actually don't know. I've not, uh... I think I did see some sort of a shop. The pawns. They bend the knee to you so readily, but then... No. Surely you cannot be the Arisen. Emma. seek the Riftstone, do you not? I'm the Arisen, I think. take you to it. Pray. Come this way. So, I hear you have to create your own pawns. I'm gonna make a harem. <laughs> Before you stands I've already decided. I'm gonna surround myself with the ladies. Tis a gate by which we of the Pawn Legion may cross over into this world. Okay. I also hear there's like no. Oh, I don't like my eyebrows. <laughs> Simply paint with your mind's eye. The loyal Those eyebrows are too bushy. Oh, okay, restart. Hey, what up, cutie chan? Yeah, we're gonna make a harem. I hear there's no fast travel in, the, in this game, or like limited fast travel. You have someone in your main pond, the loyal companion who will accompany you throughout your adventure. What should they look like? Try to envisage their appearance. You can either begin with a preset or choose to create. Uh, honestly, I'll probably just choose a preset. Do we create a kitty cat harem? Hang on. We'll just kind of go for, uh... Wait, these are, these are all the, hang on, hang on. These are all the presets that you have? Or these are just like the body types and stuff. So just go with this. Um... About like face and stuff. It's not really a lot of, uh... Oh, you said their class and stuff, too. There's really not a lot of, uh, presets here. I thought it, I was told that, um... Like, you can choose other people's created presets. So, I was wondering if somebody made Ice Spice yet. Uh... How do you, how do you choose the internet presets? Is that, is that in the game yet, or? Feminine human. Okay, it just takes us back to this menu. Yeah. Uh. Maybe we run into that later. Let's just do this for now. I'm not sure what I should, I should probably do like one of each class, right? That's probably the go-to. Mages are healers, so we should always have a healer. That's, this is kind of a no-brainer. Inclination. Do we have a... Uh, Kind-hearted, compassionate, devoted, dutiful, most obedient, sorted of pawns, fears a balanced approach with an emphasis on support. Quick to ail, 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 lies and needs. Okay, so this isn't just... 
This isn't just their personality, this actually um, affects their gameplay style. So I, so this, I want her to be a healer, so I want her to be quick to aid allies in need. Voice. The people here are evacuated and the people here are evacuated. The people here are evacuated and safe. That sounds like a little kid. The people here are evacuated and safe. The people here are evacuated and safe. What the fuck? The people here are evacuated and safe. For the moment, oh, it's just male and female, I see. There are more who can yet be saved. It seems the rain has abated. The people here are evacuated. There are more who can yet I like this one. and appear to be plentiful in this world. And I guess I like I like uh I like the way she looks too, so we'll just go with that. Name. Uh what should we name her? How about Heelatron five thousand. No. Heelatron five hundred. There we go. Her moniker. Can we just say heel? Heart. Hayabusa. She'll be heart. I guess. Finalized character. So do we have, is this just going to be our, uh, I think you can have three party members, right? It's kind of creepy, honestly. It's like you're creating clones or something. Pawns are known as crosses of the rift. We're playing so three we hours early. To connect to and traverse other uh, I just unlocked on Steam for, for US. I'm from the US. So I think it's the standard, uh, US time, I think. I know sometimes people can use VPNs to unlock games early, but when we return, I don't know such thing. It's our duty to use our experiences and the knowledge we have gained to aid you on your journey, Arisen. From this day forth, I shall serve you as your loyal pawn, and aught I learn beyond the rift will be at your disposal. Okay, so you're gonna be my heal. I don't know what you're talking about. You're gonna be my healer, okay, for when I get hit. My very eyes. You truly are the Arisen, then. Strange. I thought the Arisen was in the capital. Surely there's only meant to be one Arisen. I think the, uh... This is all beyond my ken. The, uh, the lip-syncing is, is maybe, uh, more... aimed for Japanese dialogue, because it does not look good for American for you, English. <laughs> I'm sure. Though, as luck would have it, he's away. It's kind of it's got a little bit of a sock puppet thing going on, if you haven't noticed yet. Do as you like for then. What? You've no memories, you say? Shoutouts to Capcom. He looks like a fish. Mayhap you could make for Melvin. It was set upon by the dragon not long ago. The Arisen is said to bear some deep connection to the dragon. Should you be Arisen? Mayhap you'll recall aught of import there. Hmm. Okay. The Border Watch outposts. Oh, she's casting stuff already. Maybe I should just get like three healers. I'll be the only deeps and everybody else will just heal me. Rift stones. By touching a rift stone, the Arisen can travel to the bridge, a twixt worlds. A twixt me being uh, between. I think. Or is that betwixt? Which, may, which a great many pawns traverse as they journey beyond the rift. This allows the Arisen to summon pawns who meet their specified preferences. These pawns will not level up while they are accompanying you, however, so you may find that you need to hire new support pawns at regular... In is this where you can... Uh, I guess this is where you can summon pawns made by other people, but they don't level with you, huh? So maybe I don't want to do that. Pray, ask what you wish to know. I shall answer if it is within my power to do so. Hmm. Nomads, we are oft called. Born in other worlds. However, I cannot speak as to our true nature, for I know of it not. Yeah. None of us do. The, this whole pawn thing is a little bit off putting. We merely do as we are commanded. They're like NPCs. Self-aware NPCs. 
Rift stones are gates that connect this world to a multitude of others. Okay, other people's By games. By their power have we crossed into this world. And when our mission is done... So you can, like, By summon OP pawns, probably. Tis the name given to fate's chosen. Those destined to command the portal... I wonder how many people will want Helotron 500. The of the dragon. Even with your memories lost to you, I am afraid you cannot escape your fate. Okay. Well, well. 120 RC, what does that mean? RCs. Oh shit, I did not mean to do that. Okay. They don't freak out, it seems. Sheath weapon. Okay. Whew. I've a pressing duty to which I must attend. Okay. Hell, is this another pawn? Is this a man or a woman? That's a man. So I do not want you. I have a knack for gathering items. No, get out of here. For new finds. No, get out of here. I'll gladly try out any useful mechanisms I espy. Oh, you use RC to hire pawns. Can you customize him? They can have pawn quests. This is made by Capcom, so these ones will level with me, I think. Here, cancel. Where's where are my ladies at? It's a guy. That's a guy. Oh, it's a total sausage fest here. What the fuck? What about you? Oh, she's a thief. I'm already a thief. Can we have um? Here, can I hire you? Ah, uh, oh, oh, hang on. Hail, arisen. No, you're just Hail. the tutorial Hail. person. Mayf I bet you anybody in this camp you can hire. Oh, you can grab this, too. You can just steal everything, huh? Oh, weight carried. Uh-oh, there's encumbrance in this game. Good to know. Uh, where are my ladies at? Hang on. We're gonna need a female archer, a female warrior. <laughs> we're gonna- we're gonna make a harem, okay? A treasure chest. Shall we see if we can't make our way over to it? A treasure chest? Where? Fancy a gander? I find. Buy and sell. We can upgrade our crap. I wonder if there's crafting with all the stuff I got. Curatives, restore health. You just eat in the midst of combat, huh? A sword. We don't want a sword. We want daggers for our guy. Uh, I wonder... I imagine you have to you have to gear up your pawns as well, right? Yeah. So Helatron 500, we need to She's using a wooden staff. This will upgrade her gear though, but it costs a lot of gold, which I do not have yet. It's for sale. Okay. Uh, I don't really want to sell everything I have right now. Monsters and bandits are a plague upon my business. Always Thank you for the pleasure. information. Crafting. Is there crafting? Using a range equipment. These are what? Twin daggers. Uh, maybe it has not taught us about crafting yet. Here's our party, men our party menu on the lower left hand there. Okay. Going out, are you? You sure that's a good idea? You seem rather unwell. What? You ought at least rest for the evening. There should be a spare bed in the lodge. This guy's uh the the great Mido from Ocarina of Time. He won't let me see the Deku tree. Only don't go rushing off before you're ready. Take it from me. You're so we need to get a full party. We need two more. But I don't want any of these people. It's a total sausage fest. I don't I don't want dudes. Come on. What is this? No easy thing. A oh, this guy's using a two-hander. Look at that crap. Um I guess we'll look at the Riftstone? I'm kinda scared of this because it says that your guys can't level. Right? 
Wait, what? Oh. It's saying, it's saying, uh... Your guys can't level. These, these, these players won't level, so you have to, like, constantly... Get them over and over again. Uh, no. Thickums? What are you? A sorcerer. Level 5 warrior. She costs 117. So that's what this currency is for. We need, um... A female archer. Eh... Uh, okay, okay. A woo. We can get a woo. Let's just go through these, I guess. Eh. Okay, I think I like I think I like the goth chick. It is a pleasure to meet you. We're going to go with the the gothic elf. You can add to favorites. Let's hire her. You need of an ear to listen. You have but to ask. Pawn quests. Pawn quests are tasks given to your main pawn to be completed beyond the rift. You're, you set the task and you must stipulate a reward for the arisen who hires your main pawn to receive upon the task completion. So you can make quests? Interesting. Pawn quests provide valuable opportunities for you to obtain items and acquire pawn badges, so you should endeavor to get your pawn hired as often as possible. Guys, make sure you hire Healbot 500, okay? The people are gonna, people with that name, people are gonna be like, oh, this is a healer? Okay, I want this. When setting a reward for the Arisen who hires your main pawn to receive, you can either select specific items or uh, nominate some gold. It'll be removed from your inventory. Gold will be subtracted from your funds. Oh, so you have to pay other people. Interesting. So you would want you want you want to offer high rewards so people do your quests. Did I hire her? Pray, call upon me again another time. Add to favorite. Matters of importance. If I learn of a matter that requires your attention. Okay. Uh, so now we just need a female warrior. Eldria, she's level 5. She costs 117. Osgur, thank you for the prime, man. Hope you're having a good time. I am. This is, uh, we, we kind of have, haven't gotten into much combat yet, it but... It will be a joy to serve one so gallant. I'm having, I'm having fun right now. Pawn quest, travel together for a day and night. Okay. Let's hire her. Let us work together to honor the Arisen's trust. So these, these will not level with me, so I think I need to constantly come back. Is this game worth a $90 CAD? Uh, I can't really say yet, honestly. I'm I'm too early into it to give you uh, an answer to that. Um, that looks promising. That will Any be ideas as to how we might reach it? That will be the goal of my review though, so my goal is to uh also they could be relied to save your progress in this world, recommend that you rest at ends. Okay. Rest at an end before you quit. Boy there, you seem well tired. Tell you what, you can stay here tonight free of charge. I'll expect coin from tomorrow, mind. Okay. My pa always used to say, there's not a good night's sleep. I don't care what your pa has to say. Being armed is better than being defenseless, even if you're untrained. You should stop by the inn in Melv if you get the chance. No hard. Resting at inn, staying in floor restores your party health and stamina. Also rec recovers the loss gauge, which represents... A reduction in your health and accumulates when taking damage. Oh, okay, so reduced max health. So you always want to rest. Uh, useful you need to set out at a particular time. Four-sided adventures will stay at ends regularly to avoid risks when traveling far ahead. Feelings if you prefer it. Yeah, the gold vein is to play through it. We must rest. And Very make a review of it. Up. I'm going to start making reviews on YouTube. 
first being Sekiro, but this will be my second one. So I wanna, I wanna play through this. Steam reviews. Oh, is it is it getting uh, is it getting lambasted? Never for a moment did I doubt you'd go stronger someday. Having said that, it is quite a relief. There's no discipline that steadfast devotion cannot teach. Wait, she leveled by resting? But see, my other guys didn't level. Okay. So I wonder if we'll run into like other pawns in the game. We could tell those two to hightail it. Alright, quests. I guess we'll just follow the main one. Make for Melv, and then we'll do any side quests along the way. It's mixed right now, says Vale. Hey, oh. You a soldier? It would be a surprise to see you arrive in one piece if not. Hordes of monsters. We've had to start sending out new recruits. Is that Quest? So? Lachlan. But I dare say he'll fare all right. Aye, I expect he will. Accardo. To be honest, sir, I'm a little worried. What? Weren't harpies reported in that area? The lad can't handle those beasts on his own. This is the harpies. first I'm hearing of it. Do we need Fine. do we need the harpy talons? Aid, but we can't just abandon our post. What about the lieutenant rings? Say, you seem stout. Okay, this sounds like an optional Would quest. Willing to go in our stead. It isn't far. You've my yeah. thanks. And we'll do all the quests. Setting a priority quest. Uh, quest destination is known. A mark will be placed for a map where you indicate it. Furthermore, if you have a pawn in your party who possesses a knowledge of a particular quest, they'll be able to guide you to your objective. However, Puns with such knowledge will not offer guidance unless the quest is set as a priority. Some quests are affected by the passage of time and will progress even without the Arisen's involvement. Mm, so you kind of want to do them right away, I bet you. Yeah. Okay. Right, right. So let's, I guess we'll set this as a priority quest. How do I do that? Set as priority X. Okay. So now if I have followers who have knowledge of it, they'll help me. They'll guide me to it, I suppose. Alright. Why do you guys get like full sets of armor and I'm like wearing pajamas? This is some bullcrap. Shall we see if there's all to be found while we're here? Sure. Yeah, I'm not liking this frame rate right now. Oh shit, oh god. I guess I'm not very stealthy. Pawn commands. There are four commands that the Arisen can use to direct to their pawns, and their effect varies according to their circumstance in which they are used, such as when uh, in an order of combat. The best way to get a feel for each command is to observe your pawn's response, and of course, action in various situations. Go. They act independently from the Arisen during combat. Drake's pawns is spread out across the battlefield. It can also be used to request assistance with carrying out an action, uh, to request guidance to a location, or to instruct a pawn to resume guidance. It's been interrupted to me. Okay. How do you do all of this, though? It doesn't say how to do it. Follow, wait, to wait there, help. And then that's my oh shit button. Heal me. Okay. Fresh and as we are. This how do you, how do you, oh I see, it's, okay. We must not let down our guard. Help! Go. So you want to have Come him on go mode. You, with my right there. you want to have him on go mode for most of it. Okay, wow, they just destroyed everything and I didn't do a single thing. That's beautiful. And I leveled up off of it somehow. That's amazing gameplay. Okay, so you're, you're going to have to give me a little bit to get the hang of the controls here. Um, ah, we're keeping out for glowies, too. I'm sure we'll find a purpose for it in due time. Ha <laughs> Death blow, baby. So I have to remember RB, that's my dodge. Okay, so Helatron's leveling up. 
but Eowyn won't. And neither will Eldria. I've got a good feeling about this one. I need a lootering. We have to like walk up to each corpse and loot. What are you doing? Why are you Look, attacking? Master, a chest. We Can you break the barrels for it. items? Is there no way to reach it? Ah, I see. Pop the barrels and crates for items, huh? What was that? It was well worth the effort of breaking it. It's got some Zelda, Zelda gameplay here. They said there is a chest. Where? This is this is the gathering is very Monster Hunter like. I will say. What chest are you guys talking about? I hope my followers are perceptive. I just remembered. Look how many women we count among our number. <laughs> and yet two of us are the same. Good observation. They're pointing out my uh my harem gameplay here. That's beautiful. That's awesome. Alright, where's the where's the chest? They mentioned a chest. Am I blind? Where is the chest? I'm just gonna leave. I, I, maybe they're talking about something else. I don't know. Pray, slow your feet. You run too fast for the likes of me. Oh God, I'm already Let's getting annoyed by them. Where's uh? Foot. I heard a I heard a grunt. Oh, okay, this is where our optional quest is. So let's just stay on focus here. Okay, kill, murder, murder. Let me go. Ugh. I can't reach them. I don't think I have a ranged attack. Oh god. You cannot lock in in this game if you're wondering. There's no locking in. Your your character kind of uh. Your character kind of just auto targets them if you're close. Is that all of them? Yeah. You have my thanks. I do not believe for a moment I could have slain them. I've only just enlisted, and when I thought this could be the end of me, I, I was paralyzed. You saved me this time, but I won't always be so fortunate. You're a I'll talker. I have the confidence to face such beasts on my own. Talkers make me thirsty. Well, I'd best be heading back. But I'll be sure to let my superiors know of your good deed. I hope we meet again someday. Okay, pretty standard side quest there. Pretty Shall easy. We be off? We've a report to make. Uh, okay, so back to town. So I, I want to turn this in right away because it did say that... Um... It is time sensitive, so let's do that right away. Oh no, I see the chest on my mini map. Hang on, hang on. There's a chest here. I just looked at my mini map in the lower left. You'll never reach our destination if you continue in that direction, Master. Oh but God, shut up. Oh, it's up there. It's not for us to gain Savior Risen's judgment. We must go where we are bid. Is there a mute followers button? Can you, uh... I'm wondering if you can scale walls like in Breath of the Wild. Wait, right trigger grab. Can't grab the wall? No, okay. We gotta, we gotta figure out... I get around. Probably up there and around or something. Hey, Bradvis, thank you, man. Thank you for uh, that tier one. Oh, here's a chest here. Wow, we just happened upon it. Ah, sheath. Over here. Five forty gold, baby. We might be able to buy some armor. Oh, I see. Uh, there's actual enemies over there, huh? There has to be a way to cross to get over there. There's harpies, no hawks up there too. Or harpies, I don't know. Quick for you, master. Don't worry. I shall wait for you right here. Bradvis with the five gifted subs too. Thank you. 
Thank you so much, Bradvis. Uh, my only complaint with this game really are two things. The followers are already kind of annoying me, and the frame rate, which friend. might be my computer, so I can't. was a relief to see him return, and none the worse for wear. Aye, that it was. The poor sod might not have made it back alive had you not. It was a bit too early for him to be seeing actual combat. We'll be extending his training period. The instructors here. <laughs> I kind of skip the dialogue once I read the text. I hope you guys don't mind that. Thousand gold, lantern oil, level up. I wonder if my followers get XP too. Yes, they do. I really kind of want to get rid of these ones then. Honestly. Here, how do you talk to them? We're running low on everything. From provisions to crafting materials for weapons and armor. This guy just talked to me. Hey, Bravin. Read about performance issues? I have some frame rate issues for sure. I'm not sure if that's my computer or not, though. I have computer specs down below. However, that's I'm playing on my editing computer right now, which is a, which is much weaker than that. Um, so I don't know if that if it is performance issues of the game or if it's my computer. Had a hard time procuring goods, what with all the monsters lurking on the roads alone. I sent Marcus to gather what we need, but I've just taken stock and I fear the list I gave him was incomplete. What say you? Could I trouble you to run an errand for me? Are <laughs> you glad to hear? Sure. Me? Here, take this list of you to be somewhere north and in the note, and he'll take care of the rest. This sounds hey, good. Master. I hope you like it. I found it myself. What'd you give me? Hail. No, get over here. Hold still. Uh, uh, talk. I okay, there we go. Doubt, master. Perhaps another time. Oh, you son of a bitch. So you can dismiss them. Are there any other uh, female warriors here that, like, I can recruit? Or... What are you doing? Hang on, who are you? I've got wares of every ilk. Traveling merchant? Uh... So I'm very light with my encumbrance. Implements. A modest camping kit. We should probably have one of those, right? This is how you progress. The day. I'll take one of those. Rings. Ooh. Ring imbued with power slightly increases the maximum amount of weight. It's 6,500 though. Let's just buy a camp kit. That's probably good to have. Pleasure doing business with you. Look, master, a treasure chest. We shall have to find a way to reach it. Where? Is she talking about one in town? Oops. No, 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 no. I keep doing that because it it's... I get confused with the... I scared everybody. Oh, God, no, no, no. I've beds to spare if you're looking for lodgings. And if you'd like to change your vocation, come see me anytime. You can change your vocation. Acquire and equip, equip skills. They didn't teach me about this. All manner of vocational procedures can be carried out in the guild hall. If you have unlocked a vocation, you can change it at any time. Unlocking new vocations requires discipline, which is accrued when defeating enemies and completing quests. Skills. Be able to learn new skills as you rank with your, wo your, your vocation rises. Requires discipline. Core skills can be employed from the moment they are acquired, but weapon skills must be equipped before they can be used. Uh, augments. Spending discipline. Six augments at once are like passives, I guess. Broader variety of augments can become available to you as your vocation increasing. Okay. So this is what I can learn. Oh, you can't even learn like vocations and stuff on your... Yeah, we need to get rid of the other followers. They're not like real followers. 
As soon as we find a female warrior and a female archer, we're probably going to replace the ones I have. So I have 300 DCP. That's discipline. Ooh, you can get fire blades. Oh my god. Can also be employed while clinging to or pinning down a foe. Shadow cloak. Oh, it's a stealth. Can you backstab? Can you do sneak attacks? Oh my god. Yes. We want stealth. So we will do... We will acquire stealth. Yes, put it on... Uh, I guess we'll put it on Y. And Helatron. Yeah, we're okay, we're going to have to get rid of the other ones. What are you enjoying about this already? It's hard to say. I, I guess I like the combat, but I just haven't Always had too much about shot. it yet. Or too much of it yet to really have an opinion. Um... Yeah, give me some more time. It's a pretty slow start, I'll say. So we can... No, no. Oh, God. I just want to look at my skills. Okay, here we go. Shadow Cloak. So I wonder um, how rogue gameplay is going to work with party members. Like, will my party members alert them? I have to tell them to wait. There's a ladder here. Oh, excellent There's a ladder. Find. Excellent find. You found a ladder. Holy shit. Oh my god. Great job. I don't even see it. Or is it talking about that? Okay, let's do this other quest we were given. Provisioner's note. Set as priority. Here's our world map so far. Okay, we have to go north out the outpost. Let's try to get more combat. Well, Put like a bunch of crap on myself. Our task is nearly done. I'm like Arnold in the Predator. Wait, what? No, I want to leave. I don't want to go to the training grounds. Here we go. Got to go through this gate. Thank you, salty dog. I will. Um, I can answer you guys' questions about performance the next time I stream this, because I'm going to get my, uh, I'm going to get my better computer. The specs are below, and if on that computer this game runs like crap, then I will say for sure it has performance issues. Whoa, my guy's tired. Is it because I'm stealthed? Oh god, hang on, how do you... Oh, cancel. Oh, okay. Stealthing takes stamina. And it looks like you cannot climb this. Oh, I have my followers on wait. Fair reward. We cannot complain. We cannot expect gleaming treasures around every corner. We completed a quest. I guess we can't get up there. Hmm. Oh god. Ingredients are plentiful hereabouts. Can you have your followers like maybe pick up the ingredients? That would be very helpful actually. Okay, I want to find an enemy camp and then stealth up on the asses. I want to do like a backstab. I want to do rogue things. Hey, Izzy. Uh hard to say right now. I haven't played it enough. I would say maybe give me give me like a day or two with it. Could you come over here? And I'll say if it's worth it. That's gonna be the goal of my review. I will be making a review of this game. I wanna let you guys know if it's worth it or not. What do you want? Oh, she's guiding me on the quest. Well, I mean I already have the waypoint, so it's a bit redundant. I'm trying to like gather maps gather and this. stuff. It might be oh, they do grab it. Okay, cool. They do grab mats. Yeah, this is the Elden Isn't Ring DLC, journey. you guys. <laughs> That's everything assembled. A job well done. Oi, did you need something? Provisioner's note. Deliver. Deliver the note. 
This is from Sir Geoffrey, is it? Let's have a look then. Fine. He wants these as well, does he? I thought, why should I have to do all this on my own? I've got plenty to carry us to and make haste. I would depart for the encampment even a moment sooner. Well, go on. Oh, this is the crafting quest. Combine mats. When combining, you can either choose materials individually, it's so a combination you previously tried. So you gotta, gotta kind of experiment, right? If we don't start looking. Uh, items. Combine the green warish with the apple. And we make the salibrius draught. Or is that, you pronounce that uh, draft, right? Fair amount of health. Okay, let's do the green warish with the grapes. It's the same thing. Green warish with the raspberries. Same thing. What about the raspberries? No. What about the lantern oil? With the branches, it, a torch, I imagine. Oh, tearing arrow. Okay, so you can kind of, you can kind of experiment. It optimized. What does that mean? Your items. Okay, you have a combined menu and an items menu. And here, are, oh, it shows us the recipes. So it looks like green warish in any like food item. Is your healing your healing draft okay so how do we equip those I wonder or do you have to like do you just go in your menu and use them okay imagine uh, pausing pauses the action too right that's everything on the list what say we lighten our packs by delivering it all to Sir Marcus? Talk to this guy again? This to me, Master. I'll bring you straight to the one you seek. I'm already here. We're here. in your hands, sir. Much obliged. How goes it? Have you gathered everything on the list yet? Uh, I, I don't think I have. Oh, maybe I have. Aha. Deliver. On you here. Take this for you. I'll be heading back to the encampment now. The waking powder. Okay, so that's another side quest complete. Now that what is this icon right this, here? I suppose we ought to report back to Sir Jeffrey. Gatherable. Follow me, Harspud. I'll bring you to the one you seek. I already know. Most these uh now we shan't lose our way. These NPCs speak as if like you don't have giant glowing yellow waypoints on your mini map. It's beautiful gameplay. Oi. Ah. Many thanks for passing on as I hear it. You even assisted him in anyway. You've been a great help. I hope I uh, I'm attentive and loyal and prefer to remain by your side. In battle I shall follow your lead. What? And Who are you? Do you want to like get in front of me so we can speak? Oh, it's a pawn. I think I talked to her accidentally. Willow the. She looks like a caster, I guess. Yeah, she's a caster. I already have a caster. I got Helatron, baby. They look exactly the same though. Me and me and this other guy had the exact same idea. We just made like the default lady. <laughs> I'm sure there's a lot of people who are like me who are Now there's a worthy prize. If only to work so far away. If if uh I'm not like too much onto character customization, so I just kinda Yeah. I'm saying there's a uh, chest here. This ladder looks sturdy enough to climb. We ought to put it to good use. Chest, hidden chest in here? Maybe? Ah! Aha! Look at this, you guys. First area of the game. The Fulgurous Lord? What is this? A grimoire that casts a spell upon being read. 
Usable by those incapable of magic. Okay, it's like a an Elder Scroll, an Elder Scroll scroll that she can cast. Oh God, look at this frame rate right now. Good Lord. So, um, wow, it's really laggy. So this is above the gate to leave. If you jump here, there's a chest here, you guys, for your playthrough. It looks like there's a quest up here. Yeah, this frame rate is like, holy shit. Oh, there's a chest there. <laughs> Age Scrag of Beasts. Sure, just a healing item. If your plane had arisen in search of preferable treatment, you'll be sorry. Your head is like to roll ere long. Okay. Are you gonna give me a quest? If your plane I guess not. What's the uh, exclamation mark here? Was it just the chest? Maybe I don't. I don't know. It clearly wasn't that guy. They they made a big, they made they made a big uh, fuss about that ladder. Okay, well let's just do the main quest, I guess. In Dragon's Wake, um, south of us. Okay, so we'll have to cross the river. This and I've, rather peaceful here, isn't it? I've not forgotten shame. How are we to about that, that chest. Now? So let's cross that bridge in the distance, it looks like. And maybe go around for that. Is motion blur on? Uh, maybe we can disable that. I dislike motion blur. The menus have very good frame rate, I will say. The game, not so much. Motion blur off. Let's turn shadow qualities to mid, and we'll do... We'll do this kind of lower for now, in case it's my computer. There's variable frame rate. Where was that? Uh, V-Sync. Where'd you see variable frame rate? There's vertical sync, dynamic resolution. Depth of field can cause issues. I'll turn that off for now. Lens flare. We'll just kind of put things in like on low mid. Oh, I have frame rate variable. Where was that? Is that okay? I see. I see. We'll do max sixty FPS. That probably won't help, but. see how this works. Let's give this a shot for a while. Ooh. Wait, hang on, hang on. I gotta put poop on myself. Ah, oh, they're gonna charge in, aren't you? Switch weapon skill, shadow cloak. Wait. I'll be here, but standing still is harder than it looks, you know. Oh, great. They're enemies that I can't sneak up on because they're flying. Okay, never mind. Go. Go. We have no means of exploiting our enemy's weakness. Oh, there's like gobos too. Oh yeah, put the dagger up his butt. So probably what I want to do is just kind of constantly be behind enemies. I'll gather these now. I ranked up my vocation apparently. Location when we need them most. Okay, here, hang, 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 no, 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 come on. 
Oh, we aggroed him. Okay, just go. Get the ones in the back. I played Sekiro. You gotta get the ranged first. So the the rogue guy is very dodgy. Apparently the other classes don't have this. The dash. Just kinda like a dodge roll. If you guys uh played like Dark Souls or whatever, you may be more at home with this type of character. Helatron is ranking up her vocation too. Let's just stick on the road here. to think of it oh, I'm so different tired masters favor different pawns one whom I served preferred to have bistrons for allies oh hang on here's a female warrior okay Eldria get over here you bitch I'm gonna send her away I've a knack for gathering items and I'm ever get out of here give gift what no, get out of my face. I want you to go away. Yes, get away from me. Uh, here, I'll give I you I only a... hope your memories of our journey are as fun. No. Your voice is annoying. Uh, here, you want to join my party? A grand adventure awaits us. I just know it. Reba. Oh, this is made by another guy, too. Uh, so I, I don't think I can... I don't think that I can level this one up. Delighted to meet you. Especially if we share a sweet tooth. Yeah, she sounds exactly the same. <laughs> I've downgraded. So I don't know if I can level Reba. Unfortunately. Wait, I've lost track of my main quest. Is this it right here? This glowy stuff? Okay, well here's that bridge we were talking about. We have found a material. Different combinations of materials result in different creations. This is it. Cutscene. Melva. Stronghold raised by dragon's fire. Was this dragon stone? No, not dragon stone. A heron hall, rather. So this is Melv. The scars left by the dragon's assault are plain to see. <clears throat> oh God! Excuse me. Oh, he's talking shit. Oh, okay. Well. I guess my character's playing Xbox Live right now. Well, Traveling merchant. You still selling that, that ring? Oh, it's a new one. I have 3k. Boost strength. Less likely to be knocked down. Ooh. You can buy keys for something. I wonder if these um, these grimoires are consumed on use. You know what I mean? Because I did get one. If it's just a one use thing, I, and if they're this valuable, I kind of want to sell it to buy like a ring, something that will last forever, right? Why not buy your wares here today, sir? Hope to see you again. I guess we could test well, it. it takes two to make a sale, and this seller had nothing to tempt us with. Our funds are better spent elsewhere. The Arisen is ever prudent in the application of coin. Hast thou forgotten thy destiny, thy charge? Oh. Yeah, frame rate's not the best. I need to set up my other computer. 
I'll do that tomorrow, you guys, for the next session. Oh god. Shouldn't have had that Taco Bell. Is this me in real life? Yeah. It's not as muscular as I, but it's pretty close. Uh-oh. Dracanis. Is this dogma? Oh shit, I'm controlling it. Oh god. Kill. Just kill. No, don't fall back. Impale him. Give him an onslaught. Uh, uh. I wonder if, like, jumping attacks are worth it. You can do it, right behind you. Eh. I hope he brought his, uh, Anixia skill cloak. Extra crispy. Nope, he didn't bring it. He got shadow flamed. Ooh. Oh, he took out my heart. That's metal. He sounds like Jabba the Hutt. Mmm. Get that protein. From this moment forth. Hey, base waters, thank you, man. Oh, he just eats my heart and runs? How rude. I guess I'm in Arisen now, because he ate my heart. I guess that's me, that's why I had that scar in my chest, right? In character creation. So I switched classes, I sucked as a warrior, so I, I guess I switched to Thief. She looks like the lady from Elden Ring. What's her name? The one with two faces? Uh, hang on. I'm loading, lady. Give me a moment. This game has performance issues, apparently, so you just gotta wait for that patch. Okay, what's going on? Is my computer blowing up? Can you guys hear me? <laughs> Can you guys hear me right now? Uh, if you're looking at a black screen, we have something in common. Uh, uh, maybe we got blinded and now we have, this is our, this is our character now. Maybe we just can't see anything. And controller does nothing. Uh oh. This game says that like auto saving isn't reliable and you should like manually save. I, I don't think I've... I don't think I've manually saved. What should I do? Should I relaunch? Start? No, nothing. Uh... I think... I think it's... I think it's borked. I think I should relaunch, you guys. I think it is frozen. Yeah, let's relaunch. Um, I ha also have to stop playing in a moment, too. Not to be a party pooper. But it's getting pretty late. And I, th I don't know if these performance issues are on my end or if it's the game. Some people have been saying it's the game, but... 
I'm not playing on my good computer right now, so next stream, which should be uh, tomorrow or the day after, I'm going to have my, my good computer set up. And then if it lags on that one, then for sure it's the game, because look at those specs down there in my panels. You cannot tell me that that computer would have problems with this game. Um, here, let's launch it up again. Dorgan's Dogma. Okay. It is launching. I want to see where I left off if I if that battle saved or something. I think my com my computer is going to explode. Wait, my it's window mode. Oh god, it didn't save my uh my window settings. This screen before I started stream, I let this run. This screen took like 10 minutes to complete. It's not going to take that long this time. It was like a first time loading thing. It took forever. This is also in the RE engine, which surprised me. But I guess it's made by Capcom, so... I guess it makes sense. Okay, load from last save. Let's see where this brings us. Before the cutscene, maybe? Time to be heading home. Okay, we're gonna have to do that again. Can we uh, skip... Skip cutscene? Uh, a whole day to skip, okay. Well, at least we didn't, like, lose all of our progress. All right, let's just charge in. So it says grab. I hear you can like jump onto enemies in this game to attack them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at that. This is pretty cool. And you run out of stamina eventually. But if the enemies are big enough, you can jump. Ow. What did the five fingers say to the face? Slap. Oh, my guy's so tired right now. I ran out of stamina. So you can grab onto him like this, yeah. That's cool, I actually really like that. In Monster Hunter, um, uh, my favorite thing to do would, would be to mount my enemies. Okay, skip. Let's see if we can get past this cutscene. Skip. This is where it froze, right here. This screen right here is where it froze. Me, sir? Oh. Sir? Stay with me. Okay, I think we got past it. Maybe? I don't know if we saw that scene last time. I forget. I have the memory of a goldfish. Okay, here we go. Alright, we have, we have progressed past the black screen of doom. Thank goodness. How are you feeling? It's the second time I've watched over you like this, isn't it? I don't know. I didn't play the first game. You do not remember? Then have you forgotten that you protected me from the dragon's flames? Oh, it's over. You withstood the fire in my stead and were well and truly charred. Twas we were in there, but now we're not. I have thought your life forfeit. I could not hear the beating of your heart. Yeah, I'm pretty awesome. You hung on and by some mirror arisen. I seem to have become an arisen. I don't understand your meaning. Does it have ought to do with why you were taken to the castle? They said it was so that your wounds could be treated. Hmm. So, yeah, again, very 
limited understanding of the previous plot of this game. I have a feeling a lot of this is going over my head. We are to part so soon then. Mayhap you will visit me again someday. Till then. Take care. Oh, she totally likes me. Arisen. Hey, you ever hear about World of Warcraft? Ah, I got Grand March Marshal in that one. Rank 14. You match my soldier's description. The ruler of Vermont, currently convalescing in the capital, became arisen here in this very village. If you claim the same, then word must be borne to the capital. I dispatched a missive before coming here, though I doubt the matter can be settled without your presence. Would you be willing to accompany me to the capital? If you truly are arisen, you will be okay. received with open arms. Is this the same guy from oh, earlier? Forgive me. I think we I talked to him before. In a bit to find you. I would not depart without them. We shall have to wait till they are reassembled. Come to think of it, Sir Leonard was asking after you as well. Mayhap now would be a good time to speak with him. Drink at the end. Okay, this will be a good opportunity to save. So who's going to level here? Is Reba going to level? Because I don't think she can level. No one leveled. Okay. Um, this ladder looks sturdy enough to climb. We ought to put it to good use. Great observation. I'm gonna save here. I have to go to bed, you guys. The next time I, well, well I guess we have a cutscene. You're the one who she told me all about it. it was a very, I mean, Stop dead. talking to me, Leonard. I want to go to bed. Now tell me, are you registered with a guild? I am not. Well, perhaps you already know this, but registering with a guild will grant you access to specialized training. Which comes in very useful. Pursuing a vocation. Well now, okay. that won't do. You need only speak with the innkeeper to register. Is this is how you progress your vocations, huh? To go on, it will only take a moment. If there is aught you wish to know of vocations, mayhap I can advise you. Just it gives a... a for those who seek to master the yeah. dagger. Thieves flavor light armor. Which yeah, this is, this is every RPG ever. And ability to compensate for the yeah. length of their blade through sheer... Should you dedicate yourself to a vocation, you try them as you like. So once we master our vocation, we... Um... Very well. There is no wrong choice in any... But I shan't take up any more... We can unlock time. more. Pray. Maester's teachings... Wait, they misspelled Maester. I thought it was M-A-E, isn't it? Most powerful skill that can be acquired by each vocation. Learning a Maester's teaching requires the use of a special tome, which you will receive if you impress the vocation Maester with your abilities. However, the true potential of this skill can only be realized by those whose vocation rank is high enough. So I think I'm like vocation rank 2 on Thief, which you just get by adventuring. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, sorry. I keep doing that because it, the B button is, yeah. Here at the inn, we also offer changes of vocation for those who seek I'm using a PlayStation controller, so it keeps screwing me up. I get so few customers, you see, that I can manage both roles myself. But enough about me. Did it's probably because your lips don't match your dialogue, sir, and then everybody's all creeped out. Oh my god, you're charging 1,500 gold to rest? Are you, are you kidding me? Let's talk about the guild. Change vocation. So this is, if you're, if you're regretting your choice as thief, you can be a caster, you can be an archer, fighter. Uh, this is also where you get, yeah, these as well. Helm splitter. Oh my god. It's like the, uh, the spinning attack in Star Wars for the SNES. This is some Beyblade crap right here. Look at that crap. The powder charge. You place a bomb and detonate it. Wow. Instead of like ambushes with that, I suppose. Yeah, and I can only do the core skills. Okay, I really need to like figure out how to get my own followers. So I can like actually customize them. Because right now I, I can only do these two. Okay. 
And then uh, as I unlock other vocations, I'm sure they'll appear here as well. And you can respec for DCPs. I think I wanted to do Helm Splitter looks pre pretty amazing. Look at that. That's crazy. We'll put that on uh, A. Because it's like a jump, so... Let's rest till morning. So this is how you save, or is this just resting? I thought it said you needed to save this way. Okay, never mind. Maybe you just, uh, you just save. Oh, here we go. Yeah, save and continue. You can just save whenever you want, which makes sense. Okay, um, so I know this was a short session for our, our first time playing, but I'd like to get this on my good computer so I don't have, like, massive frame rate lag. And, uh, yeah, I gotta go to bed here soon, so. Uh, thanks for watching me play video games, you guys. How are you liking this game? I'm liking it so far, but it's too early to say. I'm only a, a couple hours in, so. I'd feel bad recommending it or not recommending it at this point. Uh, I just, I'm just not sure myself. Give me, uh, once I'm maybe like 10-ish hours into it, I'll have kind of more of a handle on it to be able to recommend it or not recommend it. Ready to forge on? Um, the frame rate leg sucks, but yeah, like I said, I'm not sure if that's the game or my computer, so... We'll find that out next session, which will probably be tomorrow. I like jumping around like an idiot, though. Uh, but yeah, thank you guys for watching. I'll be back uh, tomorrow evening or the day after, and we'll, we'll really start digging into this. Alright, later, guys.